Hello, my friends. Uh, once again, Cesar Cepeda with Investment Opportunities in Texas, and I'm very, very excited to be here with my good friend Javier Smith as a president and founder of ENT Institute, which is a consulting organism for uh, businesses who they want to export or they want to establish in Texas. How are you, Javier? I'm fine and I appreciate your invitation. Oh, my pleasure. Thanks for being here. So please tell us a little about yourself, about the Institute. Well, I have been involved in uh, international trade. It is my passion. I have been uh, doing this for over 25 years. I have been in the, from the business point of view, I have been doing business in Mexico and in the US and China. I have been also working in the academia sector and the nonprofit organizations. And so I have, been, I have seen, and also working with governments and entities. So I have seen all the aspects that are important in international trade. Excellent. So our friends uh, who they're watching this video right now, maybe from different countries. This video goes to uh, close to 33 countries in a network that we have. Why mm -hmm. Texas? Texas is a very interesting economy. Uh, as a whole, it's, uh, it's the economy number 11 in the world for the GDP, the gross domestic product. The main four cities are, are the size of, uh, of a country, so several countries sometimes. It's, a, it's, it's diversified and it has all the elements to welcome investment. It is a friendly uh, state. There, have some, there are some benefits on taxes, for personal income taxes, which are not, that, not existing in Texas. Uh, very good quality of life. That's also important to mention. Definitely. And it's, it's close in, in the case with Mexico. It's, very, it's obviously a, a neighbor a state. And uh, so far, that, that's what I've seen. It's, uh, it's, it's an important place to do business. It's, it allows you also to get a feeling of the US. Uh, and, and from here, you can expand your business to any other uh, state as well. I completely agree with you. Um, for the ones that we do business in Texas, it's, it's, a, it's a great place to be. Um, tell us about the Institute. ENT Institute is a consulting organism for um, other businesses and enterprises and investors who they want to establish or export to Texas. Correct. Yes, the Institute uh, main advantage is that we have uh, our own uh, tool, which is a platform that allows you to be uh, trained in, in the different aspects of international trade. It, it takes you step by step, analyzing your product, your market that you want to reach, and also has your organization, your company in itself. So you're going to be getting points and then you arrive to a certain level because say, I feel comfortable, I know enough to do, uh, to, to start my, my journey. And uh, then that's, I think, the, the best uh, advantage that we have with the Institute. Some of our friends are thinking, this is great, the Institute will give me a platform and will give me guidance, but there's so many different aspects uh, legal, uh, accounting, different permits. How do you work on that? Well, that's that's a great question, Cesar. I I thought on that, and then since we are not experts on everything, then we created an alliances with different uh, companies here in, in in Texas. You can find that are part of our, our organizations, uh, accounting firms, uh, insurance companies, real estate. Uh, 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 virtual offices, so we, we put it all, so you, and also immigration attorneys as well. So you have all the services under one roof, done by professionals that are bilingual, that are bicultural, and that have plenty of experience. As um, the other day, speaking to Javier, as, as you know, I do business with uh, foreign nationals from different countries, and there's a common ground which I find obstacles and challenges for foreign nationals who they want to establish. Uh, sometimes we want to do business the way that we do in our countries, and uh, you know it's a different place, it's a different country, and different rules. 
What do you find the obstacles or challenges of the investor of the business um, that want to arrive in Texas? Yes, sure. The, 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 the obstacles are, are sometimes a lack of knowledge. That's why when I mentioned that we review your product, uh, your market, and your organization, is because those three elements are, are key on, on understanding, for example, your product might be selling great in your country, but then you, you have to understand about the certifications, about the changes, about the labeling. And those kind of things sometimes you don't know and, and you come and say, yeah, there's this great event, I'm gonna be there. And then you go, you spend $10,000 and in the trip and everything, and at the end you get three or four potential clients, but then you find that you're not ready. And then all that money is lost. And so that's why it is important to understand the market, the, the, the local market here, which by the way, once you understand the market in Texas, you can understand the market everywhere in the US. Perfect, yeah, make, make total sense. You describe, you previously described how Texas has uh, economic power, size, it could be a country, uh, but what else Texas is offering to the foreign investor? Well, it's, it is a friendly state for, uh, for foreigners, for, for foreign companies that want to do business here. Uh, I, I don't say that other, other states are not, but uh, Texas has developed a great network of support uh, for, for foreign companies. It has advantages comparing to, for example, California, which is the number, the largest uh, state economically talking uh, in the U.S. It's obviously too more expensive than, uh, much more expensive than Texas in general. And then we, we have seen that, uh, I have, I have uh, assisted companies coming from Spain, coming from uh, different countries in, in Latin America, and I see how com they feel comfortable. Uh, talking about San Antonio, which I am very, very familiar with, it's a great platform to start a business. The logistics also that have been developed in the, in the state are great, are, are competitive, and also you, ha you, have, you find a lot of opportunities. For example, when you are established here, you can also go back to your country or look at it and, and find opportunities that you can, uh, from here you can, products that you knew that you didn't know that existed or services that you can include in your company, in, in, in your country, and then you become more competitive. That, that I've seen that in several of my clients. Perfect. Thank you so much, Javier and uh, friends. There you have it, Javier Smith, e and Institute. If you have any curiosity, any questions, the website will show. Um, so you can um, send those questions to Javier directly. And uh, remember, in investment opportunities, we develop businesses in U.S. Any questions, uh, feel free to give us some thumbs up, some comments, we really appreciate. And if you find these videos uh, of any value, I suggest you to subscribe. Thank you again and see you next time. Stay tuned. Thanks. Thank you.